What's up guys? Welcome to a new video. So we're finally, finally, finally going to the track. Yes. So we just got done prepping the bikes. Pretty sure I got everything done. If I miss anything in this video, please don't go pointing it out because <laughs> I'm still new at this. Yes. <laughs> All right. So we're just going to go over the bikes real quick. Um, I started with my bike and I took my time. Um, I kind of learned a few things. Like at first I, I razor bladed through here where the edges are. And then when I went to go turn my light on, you could still see a lot of light shining through. So what I did is I went back and I ran the tape just over the top of the light. So it touches, it's actually on the fairing itself. Um, so now you can't see the light through it. Um, blinkers left blinker yeah that's good <laughs> all right so all the lights have been taped up the uh heathers is this gonna be an issue no it's not gonna be an issue um i'm still not done with yours by the way um we're kind of in the middle of this but um so heathers obviously she still has mirrors uh tape those up take from the inside um trying to think what all have we had to do really I got a little bit more on her headlight than I'm going to tape up right there. My mirrors and turn signals are an extra that you didn't have to do. You removed your mirrors. Yeah, see, I took, I have bar-in mirrors, and I'll show you what I did with those. Like, this is the bar-in mirror. It just, like, take these off right here, slips on over that. I didn't even bother taking that piece off because it's weighted also. Um, and I'm kind of used to having that extra length. So my hand's like down here instead of over here, I guess. Um, so anyways, um, I want it to feel as natural as possible. So I wanted to leave those on. Plus it's a lot easier to put them back on um, afterwards. Um, tail lights. Definitely had to do like three coats or three layers of the uh, black tape on the back. I didn't go with duct tape. I went with a black... Um, what do you call this stuff? Masking tape. Black masking tape. It's called Stick. S-T-I-K-K. -K. Um, got that on Amazon. Heather bought that. Um, let's see. What else? Anything else we had to do to them? Well, we've already gone over changing the coolant. Yes, we already did the coolant. We changed the coolant to the engine ice. Um, obviously, um, most tracks require that. Um, oh, now there's another thing. You're not gonna like this, but. I wish I had red tape. <laughs> wish you had red duct tape. Right, okay, so uh, the weights on the rims need to be taped up, duct tape. Um, those have to be duct tape because duct tape's gonna last. A if you put masking on tape on there, it's not. It's just not gonna work. <laughs> it's gonna end up falling off. So we went with the black, obviously, Please. for the back. I know you guys like you guys that are out there that do track days all the time. You're probably like. You guys are going overboard. You guys, this isn't a beauty contest, but you know what? We had the time, so we did it. Made it look a little bit pretty. We did it right the first time. It'll be easy to do repeatedly over and over again, so we'll do it right those times too. Yeah, so that's... Attention to detail. That's attention to detail. That's pretty much all I can think of that we really had to do. Um, anything else? I really can't think of anything else. Obviously, the tires are brand new. We tires are brand new. Them for about um, miles today, so. Literally put like maybe, what, 30, 40 miles on these tires today? Like 42. 42 miles. We just rode around the neighborhood. Um, kind of did a little, oh. little bit of riding. And then the last thing that is not yet done is we are going to add some GoPro mounts. So yes. like we're gonna add one to the tail. I don't know if it was both bikes my bike. But Probably doing them both. Because I have that I don't know if I can use this one. Yes, I believe you can. That'll be great. So There's a few things that we have to work out, but uh yeah, we're gonna do GoPro mounts in the back. Probably gonna do GoPro mounts here facing forward. Um on mine, I'm gonna run the Insta360. Most likely here, so I can film myself and whoever's behind me and get like multiple angles. Um, really, I think that's pretty much it. It's pretty... Uh, we did wash them, did it, you know, degrease, loop, chain, everything. Like, yeah. 
everything to the nines to make sure we are fully prepped. Yes. No detail is overlooked. This one has been researching for months. So, <laughs> and we're excited. I, I mean, the uh, anticipation has been growing. Because we've been talking about doing this for like well over a year now. Oh, yeah. I mean, we've always wanted to go to the track, but it was like, there was that, I had horse shows, all these things going on. And then I entered yeah. horse and vet bills and all these things. And then finally, we won the track day. And and then the Rona happened. And then Corona happened, yes. So that didn't help because we were supposed to have the wedding. That was another thing that was holding this off. So, you know what? Screw it. We're going to go ride the track. We're going to learn. I'm going to get my damn knee down. And we're going to have a damn good time. So, we're going to have a good time. Yes. And Papa Salt will be with us too. So it'll be a fun Family experience. Yes. So we're basically just going to go there, learn as much as we possibly can, take advice from people that know what they're doing, and uh, just have a good time. Absorb, Absorb everything. Yes. And uh, I think we're going to have a great experience. Yes. So we are, at the moment, we're about a week away. Um, it is December 12th or th and 13th, depending on when I upload this video. So we'll see. Uh, yeah. We'll so. probably be camping and freezing our asses off when you watch this video. Mm. So have fun laughing at us. Freezing we'll for stories. Floridians <laughs> is not freezing for the rest of the world, okay? Yeah. It's going to be like 48 the first night that we're camping there. And uh, that's probably like riding weather for most of you. But uh, for us, that's like a blizzard. So we're going to be camping. It's going to be fun. We're going to use our heated gear. We're going to use our heated gear. Video on that soon. Um, anything else you want to add to the video before I say goodbye? No. Just look at these beautiful bikes. All right, that's They're enough staring. <laughs> that's enough staring. All right, guys. Um, I think that's going to be it. And uh, uh, we are going to document a lot of this and try to give you our experience and... A lot of people have asked me, people that haven't been to the track, have asked me to document it and like show my experience, our experience, because I think a lot of people are intimidated by going to the track and I feel like you shouldn't be. Um, just be humble, go learn and have a good time. All right. That's pretty much it. And hopefully next video you'll see us. Actually, the next video I believe is going to be her little project. She's got a little project going right now. She's kind of in the middle of it. She's got, let's see this right here. <laughs> see those fingers? Yeah, she's got a little uh, bike project going on. So uh, more on that probably this week. So thanks for watching, guys. Peace and ride safe. Ride safe.